Hi, I am working on Three Ghosts by Make Market. Boo. What am I working on? Three Ghosts by Make Market. And this is a progress video for Diamond Painting with Friends 2024 Post Shenanigans with the Bergs V a Y. So go check out Shenanigans with the Berg. She's doing some sugar skulls and they're coming out pretty cool. And she's doing a Mickey Mouse, Mickey Minnie Mouse sugar skull painting. So go take a look at that. It's really nice. But this is what I'm working on. Three Ghosts by Make Market. So what I've done so far is made these ghosts glow in the dark. Let's see if you can. Can you see it a little bit? So, in the eyes, those are round drills, glow-in-the-dark round drills from a jack-o'-lantern by Make Market painting. They fit no problem. They fit right in there along with the squares. No issues. So, I am going to turn my canvas and work right in here. And I got this new tray from this company, Creations Morin. It's a really cool tray. I want it. Check that out. Love it. It's not it's not this it's not a real small tray and it's not the large one. And it's got like a washi tape trick built right in. I love it. Where is my other tray? I like the washi tray, washi tape trick. And I use a smaller tray when I do smaller projects. This is not what I consider a smaller project. This is a medium size. So, I am... Moving this so come on, why aren't you gonna stay? All right, there we go. That's better. So we are going to start with the letter U. Uh huh. Letter U. All right, I'm going to pour quite a bit in here so you can see the washi tape trick. See? It just, it's great. And I like to uh, just move them away from the edge so I don't pick up diamonds on the side with the end of the multi-placer. So, what are you all working on? Anything interesting? Now these are Make Market Diamonds and they're not sliding like the of like Diamond Club drills would be sliding. But it's all right. We can do it. Okay. Two. Are you guys finishing up your drills and chills canvas? I did not participate in that this year. 
I am going to participate in jingle drills and be frosty. Anyone else going to participate in either one of those? I am also doing diamond painting with Jack's event, Hello Kitty slash cat event. So I hope to see some of you over there. I'm also getting ready to kit up my Randall Spangler to do with the Randall Spangler event. Are you guys doing that one? Do you like Randall Spangler? I like him. He, we bought a, at the library I was children's librarian of, we purchased a mural for the wall in the story room. It's a Randall Spangler mural and it's got the mama dragon reading to two of her babies, the draglings. So when I go back to the library, I will take a picture of that mural and show Randall Spangler the mural. So he's going to be at the principal painters, not the principal painter, Mysteria, Mysteria Diamonds will have him on, on her lives. I don't know if her lives are going to be Mondays immediately after principal painter or if they will be on Tuesdays. But she is going to have Randall Spangler on her channel, on her live. So I am looking forward to that. I know there's people out there that may not like him or his artwork, but that's okay. That's why there's variety and that's why variety makes this world go around. We all can't like the same thing. So if you don't like dragons or cartoony star type stuff, you like more of a portrait, uh, you know, paintings that are of people in bright, brilliant, uh, res very bright colors. Check out Margaret, Margaret Morales. She's going to be... Um, a special guest on House of Miscellanea in the event that Naomi is holding. House of Miscellanea is holding. It's called Mary Morales. Go check that out if you have a Margaret, Margaret Morales painting. Why not do it? And Naomi's got some really cool sponsors. So go on over there. Um, that event starts December 1st, and I believe it runs till the end of January. So if Randall Spangler is not your cup of tea, that's okay. Can't be everybody's. Because we are all different. Come on. I'm getting ready to have my diamond painting class next Tuesday at the local library. I have a full class. No, full, meaning I have 10 people signed up. That's all I wanted was 10 people. This way I could help them. So we had a full class in August when I did my first one. 
It was a lot of fun. And this morning, I went to a diamond painting gathering at the local rec center. And I met about, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, about 10 women that get together twice a week to diamond paint. I thought that was pretty cool. So I do that now. That's uh, twice a week, Tuesday and Thursdays. They're all older women. And there is one gentleman. He paints. He made a Christmas tree and put and painted the Christmas tree and added gems to his Christmas tree to represent ornaments. It came out really, really nice. So this painting that I'm working on right now it's not one of my favorites. It's not that the quality is bad or anything, because it's not. Quality is good for what you pay, but I'm just not really liking the image. So I will work on it until I've had enough <laughs> of the image. And then I will put it away. Either maybe one of the women that I just met today will finish it. I don't know. There's only one way to find out, and that is to ask. So I will be, most likely I will be asking because I'm not feeling it, guys. Just not feeling it. Not for this one. I want to get working on my Randall Spangler. But I have I'm I haven't even kitted it up yet, so that's part of the process. So I'm gonna kit it up and I can't do any of it till the first. So there will be another stash video. Yeah, I have I have a lot of stash. So There is license stash. Almost, I'm done with almost all of my license stash. Actually, I think I am done with all the license. And then I have a bunch of budget friendly before I realized there was a difference. When I had just found out about diamond painting, um, we, my mother-in-law has a bin store by her house so we would go there just to get out of the house and go do something and I started finding all kinds of diamond paintings and I thought I hit the jackpot and I did think I hit the jackpot until I started my YouTube channel and then I realized not everything is what it seems. So, so I still have them and I do work on them. I work on them at my leisure. They're good traveling kits because they're not big. They're smaller in size. 
not as many colors, which is good. They're great to give to people who have not tried diamond art to see if they just like the basic process. I have given some away to friends and my niece. They're good starter canvases, I guess is what I'm saying. Now, let's talk about this painting. This is 24 colors with an added AB drill that I added in and glow-in-the-dark glitter added that I added. The colors are not very bright. It's very, well, it's three ghosts. It's Halloween. It's, it's dark. It's, uh, I don't know. I added the glow in the dark to give it some brightness. But to me, it's, you're only going to see the glow in the dark if it's at night or you have the lights out. So, there's that. So, unless you're going to put the lights out every time you want to look at it, you're not really gonna see that it's glow in the dark. The drills are faceted, they're not smooth tops, so they do shine. And they're They're rough feeling, even though they're faceted. They're rough feeling. My son has done <clears throat> the solar system by Make Market. Now that one came out super, super nice. I have that in my collection. I plan on doing that one. My, fun, my son got it complete and even made a frame for it. It's hanging up above his couch. And it looks nice. I have been saving the trash drills right here. So far, I think there's a lot. But they do fit nice. 
I'm not having a problem with them fitting. They're staying. I have not had an issue with popping drills. So that's a plus. They do slide easy though. I'll show you, I'll put one where you can see it right there. And then you can just watch my pen. See how easy? And it might be because I'm in my garage and it is warm in here. Could be, I don't know. So I muted my phone, but I did not mute the computer. So my text messages are coming in on my computer. But it is what it is, guys. So I figured I'd pop on, tell you about the project. Yvonne with shenanigans with the Bergs. She's doing a great job with the event. The whole idea of their events is for you to try out new YouTube channels and get to know other people in the community. So if you go on shenanigans with the Bergs, click under her comments. I mean, her, uh, in the basement, I guess everybody calls it. And take a look at the different channels where people are participating in this event. And go uh, like and subscribe them. I do shout outs on Friday, which there will be one more. I am not sure if I'm going to continue with the shout outs. I may still have some kind of shout out Friday, but it may not be channels. It may be shout out of events or um, I'm not sure. I'm still thinking about it. I'm trying something new. So we'll see what I come up with. Who knows what I come up with? I, I don't even know yet. Who knows? If anybody has any ideas, I'm going to be doing the fall questions. I think that'll be on Tuesday. I'm not sure when yet, so but they're they're in the it's in the making. Or you may have already heard them. I don't know. If you've already heard them, let me know if you're going to do them. Because they're open to anybody. Anyone can do them. Did anyone buy any Christmas paintings this past Saturday? I don't think I did. See, I'm talking, I'm filming this before Saturday. And I'm going to try not to order 
and wait until Black Friday or Black Saturday or whatever you want to call it. So I'm going to try to wait for that. Wish me luck. Yeah, wish me luck. They say this hobby is actually two hobbies in one. It's It turns into a collecting hobby and a doer hobby. Are you more of a collector or a doer of the hobby? I am a doer, but starting to be a collector. So I am going to try to slim that down. And my husband doesn't help because he's very supportive. And he understands um, when you see something that just came out and might not be out for a while. You know, it will only be out for a small amount of time. He's a ham radio operator as, as I am. But he's active in it. So when they come out with new radios or gadgets or whatever, he buys them because something he just bought something and he was worried about it being discontinued. And sure enough, it got discontinued and he was glad he bought it. So he's like, if you see a canvas you like, get it. So I started asking him, are you going to do these paintings? And he's like, well, no. Okay. So now he's backing off a little bit because <laughs> I can buy. That's not the issue. But the issue is completing them. Am I going to com complete them? Or are they going to sit there? And I really don't want them to sit there because every time I get a new one, I want to do it. I want to start it. So. Come on. Yeah, it's hard to just uh, get a canvas. And I love opening them, but then I don't, don't do them right away, as a lot of people. I don't want to kit it up. I love kitting up, though, but I don't have enough storage. I don't know where to put them. I, can, I have enough storage for about three or four paintings, one large painting and about three small ones. And the diamond paintings are stored in, my, in our guest bedroom for when people come over. Well, if people come to visit, well, let's just say I hope they don't need a lot of closet space. There is plenty of dresser room. I have a whole dresser that's empty except for one, one drawer. But that doesn't have diamond art in it. That is, uh, it's just got something. It's just got, I'd rather not say what's in it. It's kind of personal. But one drawer is occupied. So yeah, apparently I left the dog outside and now he's mad because he had to be a dog for a few minutes. So my husband, Mr. Pampered, just let him in. So I can't wait to try this tray with Diamond Art Club diamonds drills. So 
I have a feeling it'll it's going to be a little different. Oops. These make market drills are not working the best in this tray. Come on. And they do line up. They line up okay. See? That worked out pretty good. So yeah, I think when the event's over, I may bring this canvas into the group of ladies that I now diamond painting with, diamond paint with, and see if they want to work on it. Because I'm not, I'm not having fun with it anymore because it's uh, kind of dark. I like colors. Come on. Wow. Got a drill stuck in there. That was stuck in there. Come on. All right, let's try this again, shall we? That was really weird. I've never had a drill do that. It got, it got stuck right in here. Has anyone worked on this canvas? The three ghosts? What did you think? Is it bright enough for you? Do you not mind dark canvases? I obviously do. Yeah. 
not not a fan. My husband thinks I should finish it though. I do want to finish the ghosts. So I may just finish the ghosts and up to the fence right here and see how it goes. But Okay, Nancy. Okay. This right here is going to be the glow in the dark glitter. So I don't want to get too close. Oh, there's a weird one. There you are. I got all the use there. Yeah, I think this has to do with the heat in my garage. All right, I think I have completed the use in this section. Now for my favorite part of this tray. Beautiful, oh my gosh. I love it. So that is what I'm completing today. All the spots right in here. Like I said, I'm going to complete the ghosts. And I think up to the case, which is right here, and I'll finish all this. But I think that's all I'm going to do on this canvas and try to give it away to somebody. If one of you want it, want to finish it, let me know. Let me know in the comments. And maybe.
maybe you'll get a gift. That's what I have today. Thank you.